Hi and welcome to another Bruja video. In this video we're going to look briefly at uh, how to aerate your wart. Uh, wart aeration is important in that it puts oxygen into the wart which is necessary for the, the yeast in fermentation to build healthy cell membranes. Without the oxygen the yeast um, cannot form as strong cell membranes and this may lead to off flavors in your beer and worst case it might even lead to the yeast um, uh, not being able to finish completion due to growing uh, alcohol levels inside the, the beer. So in order to put uh, oxygen into the beer you need a wart aeration stone. This is a 2 micron stone. It puts small bubbles uh, up through the beer so that there is maximum interaction and diffusion from the air into the beer. So that wart aeration stone is available online. In addition you're going to need a pump. There are a number of aquarium pumps that are available online for relatively inexpensive. From the very low this Fusion Quiet Power 200 is about $15. Uh, we recommend however going with a slightly better pump. The Fluval Q2 for example has about double the power output and double the PSI uh, of the smaller model and it also has a controllable dial on it to control how much air you're putting in. The extra power is useful because particularly with the larger fermenters there's quite a bit of downward water pressure on the air stone and if you don't have enough power to get the air into the wart then you're going to have very limited uh, uh, air going in. So to go, f these pumps all come with a 1 8 inch hose barb. On the aeration stone there's a quarter inch hose barb. Uh, in between those two I recommend putting a uh, filter. There are uh, sterile syringe filters that can be found online on Amazon. They have the same size connectors as the pump so they would fit very conveniently onto the pump. They just slide on it like that and then you're not inoculating your freshly sanitized wart with molds and bacteria from your air. Once you've sanitized your hose you're going to connect it up. This is standard uh, aquarium sized hose so it's going to connect to that filter on the other side of it you need an adapter to go from the 1 8 to the quarter inch which is the size of the air stone. This adapter can be found on Amazon as well uh, through companies like Metal Air for example. So that just connects to the air hose. The air hose goes into the sterile syringe filter. The adapter goes into the quarter inch hose and the hose goes onto the air stone. The air stone is going to connect to the bottom side of the uh, fermenter. We're going to open the valve on the bottom then, turn the pump on and let air into the wart. It's recommended if you're using pure oxygen that you aerate for a couple of minutes. If you're using air however because the percentage of oxygen in air is only about 20 percent it takes longer to do it and for that they recommend it's recommended about 10 minutes. Uh, you probably want to be do about 15 minutes if you're on the large 3-in-1 or BIAC. So that's it. If you have any questions about where to source any of this stuff or how to hook it up or other questions about aerating your wart feel free to send them in to us anytime using the form on the website. Thanks for watching.